welcome to another episode of Click Bay with me, Mametra. On this show, on this podcast, we talk about things that you're able to relate with. We talk about things that concern Gen Zs, millennials, and everybody. You know, you are in this parenthesis. You know, yeah, you, you, you watching. And today, I have beautiful people. And so, until introductions, I have to my left, Mami Fwajaba. The lady in shades. Okay. <laughs> and <laughs> period. <laughs> her. <laughs> and next to her, I have Hilary Esther. Hilary. Hey, oh, but yeah, my yeah, I only are you problem me. Yeah, baby. But hey, Hilary. Okay. So, ladies, today, what are we talking about? We are talking about whether or not it is important to share your phone or your passwords with your partner. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. (laughs) So let me take um, preliminary, you know, comments. Let me Mm -hmm. start with Hilary. Hilary, what do you think? Do you think it is important? Would you share your phone's password with your partner? (laughs) Well, it's, it's a simple no. I don't think it's necessary to share my password with my partner. I mean, what do you want to know? Whatever you want to know, you can ask me. I can show it to you. I wouldn't say no. You don't have to see. I'll show it to you. So I don't think it's that important to, you know, share my password with my partner. No. Okay. We'll come back to that. (laughs) FY. With me, uh, it will depend. But I feel like, okay, people would say um, they would share. No, they won't do that because of trust issues or something. Mm -hmm. And in a way, I feel like you shouldn't base your um, trust only on you getting to know my phone password or whatever. Mm -hmm. But you can get to know, we can build a trust through um, open conversations. Um, Yeah, when you get to know stuff I do, like we Mm -hmm. talk a lot. Yeah, Mm -hmm. I can share my passcode with you, but... This is me. Maybe I'm not even a phone freak. So with that one, how are you going to manage it? Are you going to say that um, I'm not trustworthy or I'm I'm like maybe okay because you're not seeing anything on it. Yeah. You might mm. end up saying, oh yeah, my phone is honest and all of that. But mm. here we go. I don't even do anything on yeah. my phone. But you know my <laughs> passcode. So in a way, I don't. I feel like uh, it, it. It should depend. It should depend on both of you. It should depend on the people in the relationship. Mm-hmm, Is that mm-hmm. what you're trying to say? Yeah, that's what I think. Okay. Should I should I add my comments or should <laughs> I just leave it be? Cause I have a different I have a different view. Okay. But I'll hold on to my comments anyway. <laughs> Hillary, you don't you will not share your phone's password. Do you have reasons why you wouldn't want to share your phone's password? Uh, I don't have any peculiar reason. I just think my phone's password is something private. You know, it's my phone. Whatever I do on it, it's it's me. It's mine. If you want to know, you can just go straight, ask me, oh, baby, can I see this message? You know, I'll show it to you. It's not like I'm hiding anything, you know. So I just, I don't have any reason for not sharing. I just don't think I should share it. Yeah. I mean, if if you think I'm not trustworthy i can share my password with you you know ladies are smart men are also smart all right but ladies can be smart when they want to i can share my password with you please don't tell on us now just just don't tell us then don't tell on us now don't tell on us now okay okay don't don't tell on us now okay let me use today is a sisterhood lesson is a sister sister something don't give the boys the code you know (laughs) yeah okay well men as i said earlier men are also smart Mm. so you can share your password with me and i'll go through your phone and then you know see your conversations and all but there are certain conversations you have with other ladies i wouldn't see you can hide it somewhere i wouldn't see so i don't think sharing my password with you or you sharing your password with me should be basis for me being trustworthy in this relationship or you you get it but so if a partner is withholding his or her password won't you feel like this person is being secretive? No. You won't <laughs> feel like the person is holding information or trying to keep something from you. No, 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 no. I I'm not asking only Hillary. If one the way you have, you've, you've kept your shades on is like you are blocking away the haters. No, uh-uh. no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. I want to, I want to land. Yes, mm. I, I have already landed. <laughs> Plain that, that, that was so quick. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. With me, I, I, as I said earlier, I don't mind, but I feel like um, 
it's, it's just a mutual understanding. I don't mind sharing my passcode with my partner. Mm. Um, as long as you give me mine, um, you give me yours, I also give you mine. Why not? I get to know your bank app, your passcode is very necessary. I get to know your... Uh, okay. uh, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think... I don't think I'm yeah, trying so hard to hold on to my laptop. Yeah. I'm going to hand your, Yeah, your more yeah. money pin. I get to know. It's no problem. Yeah, I don't mind more sharing More money my, pin. Yes. With me, uh, my account is always empty, so I don't mind sharing with you. So, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's no big deal. Yeah. I don't mind sharing my passcode with my partner. Because everything the trust is there everything so i know i'm not hiding anything there is nothing sneaky mm. so i don't care if you go through my chats you go through my instagram everything you i just would, don't care you've even furthered the conversation you would even go uh, to the extent of giving your instagram passwords to i don't mind but what yeah. of your privacy yeah mm-hmm. i believe that we all have our boundaries so if if with me whatever i'm looking for i think i should apply same to my partner if I don't want you to go through my Instagram page, my WhatsApp, whatever, I also not go through yours. Because once I start invading in your privacy, I've already um, broken that boundary. It also gives you the guarantee to also step in mind, like go to my WhatsApp, my Instagram, and then access everything because I equally do the same to you. So mm. there will be no boundary. Mm. Yeah. So me, I don't mind. I don't mind sharing my passcode with my partner. But do you think that boundaries are important in relationships? Do you think boundaries are important? Because this is somebody you are going to be butt naked with. <laughs> you guys are going to do things yeah. with each other. So, do you think boundaries are important? Yeah, to some extent, there should be boundaries. Okay. I mean, for example, the phone case. You don't have to go through my messages. I mean, I am the one chatting with someone else, not you. There is no need for you to go through it unless I want to show you something within the message. So, that boundary should be there. You should respect my privacy. I also respect yours. So yeah, there should to some extent there should be boundaries. But do you want to go through your partner's phone? Me, I want to go I want to snoop <laughs> I through. I want to see who are you sending hi to, who are you sending ba- <laughs> if you send yeah. baby. I want to see. Who I want the, to see yeah. who that person is. You're right. Well, I don't want to I don't want to go through <laughs> I have no business going through your phone. If if there's one particular thing I want to know, I'll ask you about it. If you mm. decide to show me your contacts, your chats, that's cool, but I won't come and ask for your chats now. Nah. I don't want heart aches. I mean, we are humans. <laughs> of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with me, with me, I'm very emotional. Yeah. You know, I just don't want to react. You know, they say what you don't know doesn't kill you. So yes. it's better you yes. don't go into it. Yeah. Yes, it's better. You can, you, you can, you can equally share past, you know, in terms of emergency or something. Imagine just that maybe um, you are in a serious, a critical condition or something. Yeah. And mm-hmm. then your here lies the case. Your partner doesn't know your passcode. You okay. want to call an immediate family member, blood donation, something. But here lies the case. Everyone is being secretive. So at this point, yeah. it, death can invade in it. Ube wa ube. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is but, true. <laughs> you be one will last there. But you are talking about heartache. What, don't you want to find out if you know there was somebody who was telling me that um, no matter how comfortable you are in a relationship, uh, you should find out whether you are the main chick or the side <laughs> chick or who the do be true movie <laughs> something like that. Wouldn't you want to know? No, I wouldn't want any heartaches. So far as you are in a relationship and then we are both serious about it, I don't think there's a need to check if there's someone else besides me. If accidentally I realize that oh Sana or before for sure, then that's a different case. But I wouldn't go, you know, checking. No, 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 no. I'm okay where I am. If I'm not, I would leave. That's it. But stuff like this, your the guy's actions will even tell. Yeah. If you are the main chick or the side chick. It's not you going through his chats. It's going to make you know that, oh, I'm the side chick. I'm the second girlfriend. Mm-hmm. No. It's like his actions. He's not there for you all the time. Yeah. He's always busy, busy, busy. Yeah. Come on, but you get time to eat. You can't call me whilst <laughs> eating. So with that one, it's no excuse. You'll find out through his actions if you are the main chick or you are the side chick. It is not his chat that... Guys are also smart. He comes yeah. now disappearing messages 24 hours. <laughs> no, but gone. you know, WhatsApp is not so smart. WhatsApp is... Oh, obey you one message, yeah. It yeah. will just write in there. <laughs> this person is using disappearing messages. It will he go can't after you. Now most of them yeah. use Snap. Because okay. disappearing after view. So if, if he wants to cheat, he will cheat. It's not you going through the, the phone. You get me? So, yeah. <laughs> I see, I see. But if somebody is 
purposely you know like um if i said that she would want to do it if it's you know hand go hand come like you're sharing mm. yours with me and i'm sharing mine with you if you want to share or if somebody wants to share with you your partner wants to share with you and you don't want to share with your partner does that make you not trustworthy at this point it start you start setting in doubt for yourself yeah mm. like babe i want us to go transparent we should get to know each other blah, blah, blah. and i go like no babe we all have to know our boundaries at that point you see he start having yeah. some guilt um what is so wrong why are you um trying to prevent me from getting to know your passcode and all of that it, it can create conflict and all of that so in this case i think both of you it will depend you just have to talk to me maybe okay babe this is the case i'm not oh. forcing you to give me your, your passcode. password i'm not yeah. interested yet at this point we should all know our boundary and our privacies no one should invade in anyone's privacy. for instance if you told me that oh babe um i don't want you to be at my workplace maybe uh unannounced don't call me, like you need to call me you know something like this this is a point no surprises <laughs> yeah you know he's also bringing in his boundaries yeah. if you are trying to set in he can also start in so mm. things like this i don't think it's advisable because when we start doing um i have my boundaries i have my he'll start bringing in tough ones which you might be burning mm-hmm. mm. so in this case i feel like you should you should you should both communicate mm-hmm. and then if it is understood that uh, if you are ready to also go by his boundaries then you should have no problem but if you are not ready don't set it <laughs> if you are not ready don't <laughs> set it yes if you are not ready don't <laughs> set it so at what point in a relationship do you think like we should talk about, we should even have this conversation about whether sharing passwords even if it's on the table when, at, at what point in the relationship should it be on the table for us to talk about this well i don't think there should be a timeline but i mean when you guys are serious there might be a case where you'd want to you know push that in mm. do, do you mind me you know sharing my password with you yes i don't think there should be some timeline when you are getting serious when you're serious maybe you're getting to marriage yeah maybe maybe you can bring that conversation up but i wouldn't bring it up <laughs> Hilary, there's something you're hiding in your phone. We have to find it. We have to find what is in your phone. We have to definitely find what is in your phone because <laughs> when you are getting to marriage, Eva, do you think the same? Um, when you are getting to marriage, for that one, you can't even be told. Trust me. So me, I'll just advise. You know, sometimes at the talking stage, now men are smart. He won't even propose to you. You don't even know at this point is he my partner or not. You but you just started mm-hmm. and then talking stage and all of a sudden you feel like you are dating it, mm. you know. So you should. I feel like if both of you, you finally agreed that yeah you are my boyfriend I'm your girlfriend we are moving. So this is the point where um you both can talk. You start talking about what you don't like, what you like, what you don't mm-hmm. like. So I think that is the point where um you can start setting that rules if you are okay to share your passcode with your partner. Yeah. I see. Hillary, you are saying that you would never want to share your password. So if in <laughs> case, in case you guys even get married, you still not want to share your password. Uh, maybe. Uh, your future husband is watching. <laughs> your future husband is watching. I mean, you can't tell what the future holds for you. So maybe there may be a case I'd have to share it. But I just don't think it's a necessity, you know, for you to have your partner's password. I just don't think so. Yeah. And I don't think you should go through your partner, your partner, sorry, your partner's messages or chats. So, nah, why do you need a password? That's my problem. Why do you need it? Why is it a necessity for me to share it? You understand? So, hmm. <laughs> what they did 11 years now, we are worried because they didn't check. They didn't check. No, no. If, if you're unfaithful, you can, you can tell from someone's actions. You don't necessarily... Okay, fine. The chats can pr- can have some sort of yeah, proof yeah. to your infertility. But then, uh, if you're unfaithful, you would know. You would know. I mean, you would know. Like if I say, now people are smart. Too. People are concealing yeah. their actions and then, you know, putting dots at where okay. they're supposed to put it. They're doing everything <laughs> right. But behind you... They are me, doing yeah. things. Me, I don't mind if I uh, giving my passcode to you or rather build that trust. I can give it to you. That's what I'm always I'm saying that. Um this thing, even social media, wherever the phone is not the only tool or means where unless maybe you are tracking my course. 
or something. Because hey, obviously, <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> no, that's not yeah. But that's what I'm trying to say. That if yeah. you are just um, you want to center your trust on me giving you my passcode, yeah, then I don't mind sharing it with you. If that is where your mindset. Like that's where you are setting up your mind that, um, oh my baby has I have a password she's trustworthy. Like I don't mind giving yeah, you because once because once yeah when I tell you yeah when I tell you I'm not going to give you my passcode that's when you go mm, babe what are you hiding it's going to create a whole lot of problems yeah. so to seize everything I would give it to you even at the end of the day the phone will be yours now so yeah, the phone will so, be yours so, <laughs> yeah the phone will be yours yeah why would you be using the phone with him oh. So in this case, I'm not going to use it anymore because you, your whole mindset is you want to go through my phone and everything. That, that's a red flag for me. Why should you center my trustworthiness on you having my password? It's a red yeah. flag. I mean, you can't trust me without having the logins to my phone. Then mm. why are we together? Do you, do you get me? You, how? How is that even possible? It shouldn't yeah, be right. grounds for which you'd you know, hold me to that trustworthiness. No, it shouldn't. It's a red flag for me. <laughs> you saying yeah. that, Zinana, I was like, hey, maybe I mean to me, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Maybe what? I yeah. don't want, I don't want any problem just for you to be okay. If that is what's going to make you fine, I don't mind. Give it up for the understanding girlfriend. Yeah, let's give it up for the understanding girlfriend. Go you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Period. <laughs> No. <laughs> yes. But, but do you find it controlling? Is that why you find it as a red flag? I wouldn't say controlling. I was just it's not necessary. It's I just don't think it's necessary. Like mm-hmm. a cra. I mean if you want to check something on my, on my phone, you can politely ask me, Oh baby, let me see this. That's cool. But you change now you want to have my password i mean there are certain conversations it's not like i'm cheating maybe there is an opportunity coming my way but i don't want you to know yet i want want it to be legit before i share with you then you having the logins to my phone you'd see all those conversations no no there should be that boundary It's, it's not necessary Mm. Someone said that you can't even surprise your boyfriend anymore <laughs> because when you buy the package, he's already he, he's aware fresh, that yeah. this one is on my yeah. way and on the way yeah. coming to me. Even now, you yeah. know, due to technology, you hide whether you're hiding your passcode, you don't want to share it. There are a lot of ways they can even track your WhatsApp just with your number. He mm-hmm. can have access to your everything on your phone. On his phone, it's going to be like a dual something on his phone. Yeah. So whether you give it to him or you don't give it to him, mm-hmm. he legitly has access to everything, yeah, tracking you, your yeah. movement, wherever you're waving your calls. I don't want police. <laughs> <laughs> of course, you know some men. There. What, yeah. what do you want, boy? Yeah. Yeah. Some I mean, men, some men go to that extent. To do that. Yeah. Some men go to that extent. Oh. That's this. another red yeah. flag. Of course. <laughs> But girls, Moody throw too much. <laughs> and it, you guys lie too much. Girls lie too much. Uh, there was yeah, a lie. Same, was a lie. same gender. <laughs> Fear women. Fear men. Fear men. You can't tell me. Do we have a question mark? Hey. Fear men. <laughs> calm yeah. down. Calm. <laughs> so, goodness. Me, I think I would share my password. Because of various reasons. Mm. One, I'm very clumsy when it comes to passwords. <laughs> Like, I will set a password today. Tomorrow morning, you ask me, and I don't even remember what I did. (laughs) And I have a pattern. For example, if I'm using me and my partner's name to um, as as the password, it will be the same for every app. Mm. So it will be easy for somebody to hack me or steal my password or what have you. But if I pick something that is outrageous, I would have to share with my partner. And I, I don't know, there's this flexibility that i i feel when i share it with you because sometimes there are some messages that i don't even want to reply i'll just call you that please can you reply this message in my instagram <laughs> dm for me because it's like ah yeah. i don't know okay. what to say this person is pestering me i don't know what to tell the person mm. the, i find it to be nice me my mom with scenario <laughs> and you we have second understanding I mean, girlfriend yeah. here oh <laughs> Yeah. Oh, mm-hmm. oh, so see, I'm in a Mexican understanding. <laughs> assistant, oh, you're all assistant, you know? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, your reasons are really valid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. because with, with what you're saying, yeah. your passport's like this. I mean, um, it gives you, um, he become not he becoming a reliability, but then 
it helps you like the way i like sometimes you might be caught up with some stuff yeah. but you end up calling him to reply this message for you yeah. and maybe you have a time frame mm. that maybe by 5 p.m you need to reply this message but yeah. since you are caught up with something your partner can actually you are right with that i agree with you too on that so am i convinced you am i drawing you to my side or are you still <laughs> in your position hillary <laughs> <laughs> i i still stand by my words i mm. mean it's not necessary but i mean there can be a time where i'd have to give it to you but it's just not necessary and it shouldn't be the grounds for you to measure me being trustworthy mm. yeah okay <laughs> Let's toast. Okay. Cheers to <laughs> bad girls for life. <laughs> Gen Z buddies, yeah. yeah. Period. Period. Mm. So for those of you who want to know what we are drinking, we are drinking the blood of Jesus Christ. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Preach <Amen. laughs> <Bridge> on. So, <laughs> so let me put it in a scenario like this. Okay. If you meet a handsome guy, yeah, side eye, side eye, <laughs> and this person you did this person into like six months and then this person is willing to share his password his phone's password his instagram password um twitter whatever whatever you want without you even asking hmm. we are manifesting such men i mean they are in our imagination but amen, amen. <laughs> yeah would you would you be happy or would you love to have such a person with me i always say that if you know you are not ready for it, someone like me, I'm ready to do that to also share mine. So when I get someone like this coming in, Hello, stop the with, side eye. <laughs> stop the when side I eye. Come, when I stop get the side like eye. Me, <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> yes, when I get someone like this coming in like that, I don't mind sharing my passcode with you. So I'll, I'll I'll be glad to accept it. But ladies, it's a trap. If you are not ready like me, please don't don't go in for it don't accept it but if you already like me you can embrace it now it's not a trap there are good men out there i don't know good men out no, there no, no no it's too clean it's too clean <laughs> i mean we've been dating for six months then or you want to share everything with me nah for all you know he has deleted whatever damning conversations he's had with someone mm. and he's given it to you on a clean slate for you to also you know do the same then what do you want then mm. you see everything nah it's too clean for me <laughs> it's too clean hmm. it's a trap i mean now. it's it's nice it's mm-hmm. to some extent it's nice oh but now it's too clean yeah i'm ready for it so when it comes ha, huh, i'm ready to embrace it but if you are not ready that's what you can say it's too clean or it's a trap <laughs> but me i'm ready so when you come i'm ready so I'll you give... think it's not a trap oh uh, no i don't think it's a trap with me i'll <laughs> accept it because i'm ready to share mine so i'll accept it <laughs> You're ready to go the same length. You're ready to go yes. the same extent with him. Yes, yes. I see. But if if the person is having such conversations with people and he's cleared it, don't you think that they will re or care? There'll be recurring messages. Because Absolutely. if we are flirting with someone and then you delete it and you give your password to your boyfriend, the person doesn't know that you, you've deleted it and given <laughs> yes, your password yes, to yes. your boyfriend. Yeah. One day, what's on my bed? Hi, yes, baby yes. boo, I miss your boo thing. Yes. <laughs> then... Maybe you, you got the last time. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe the last time we went to the cinema. Oh, it has popped up. Hey, yeah, right. Still, men are smart. Hey. Hey, he can give an excuse to that. Oh, we just had a group cinema movie something. Ooh. He can give an excuse. Men are smart. But no. there are certain things, you know, like what she said. That, yeah. Um, I miss your 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 boo thing. Something. Yeah. <laughs> something like this. How are you going to explain to me? How? How? Ah. Explanation. Nothing. Still, still, still. I don't fall for that. Hey, no. Hillary, you don't no. want a good man. <laughs> No, 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 not that. You guys are making me look bad. It's not like I have something to oh, hide. No. But I just, no, I just wouldn't. Maybe, maybe, okay. if I'm madly in love, hey, I might. Okay. I, after all, I have nothing to hide. Even if <laughs> even if I'm not good. so 100% into yeah. you, I still have nothing to hide. But I just, 
Me who to tell me why? Why should I share it? You understand? Oh, what it was all the password, baby. Yeah, people are ready. I'm never ready. That's not. If there are good men out there like that who are ready to share their passcodes, their Instagram bank accounts, more people. Their bank accounts. The bank accounts are interested. She's not interested in the WhatsApp and Snap. The bank accounts. The WhatsApp now. Disappearing mess. Everything can go. It's like what you don't know doesn't kill you. Me, I won't take your phone. And go through your WhatsApp yes. messages. No, 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 no. For what? What I don't Which know won't kill me. Maybe when I get to see that you are flirting with someone, ha, ah, my heart, it will sink. So I, I won't check it at all. No, no, <laughs> no, no, no. Hmm. Sinking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I'm not ready for that. Ha, ah, my heart. Yeah. <laughs> Goodness gracious. So, if 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 you are not ready to share, and he is ready to share, what becomes of the relationship? Then? But would that be would that be a benchmark for you to feel that this person is trustworthy if the person willingly shares it with you? A bit way be a mouse at this boy. If Radim Hun is so bad, my dad cries. No, I wouldn't read too much meaning into it. If you are ready to share, okay, that's cool. It's normal. If you are not, that's fine. I won't read so much meaning into it. And I don't think you should also think that me not being ready to share means yeah. I'm not trustworthy. No. If you mm-hmm. think that way, then it's a red flag. A red flag in your own him. No. him. <laughs> <laughs> with me, as, Man, I said, yeah. with him. as I said earlier, I don't center my trust on you sharing your code with me. Hell no. I always center my trust on open conversations. Come on, you come from work, you tell me what's happening, you tell me mm-hmm. um, whatever is happening in your life. Like we talk, mm. I get to know everything about you. I'm okay with that one. I won't censor my trust because you're not sharing your passcode with me. No, 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 no. I'll but, say, but rather yeah. when you're hiding stuff from me, yeah. maybe um, you are having a property somewhere. You don't tell me you're opening a business <laughs> and you project. You don't tell me anything about it. Mm-hmm. I hear it somewhere. That's when my guilt sets in. But I won't censor my trust on you not giving me my passcode. Your passcode, no way. No, no, no. I won't censor my trust on that. Yeah. You're talking about open open conversations or being transparent. <laughs> Do you think that if your partner has gone to work and some secretary has pulled her skirt and showed some small bomb, bomb and boots, you come home and come and tell you, baby, you know what? And, and, to, and, but the, you know, no. and the palm, my secretary, but you, know, you know no. what she did? You, you think she'll, she'll no, come and tell you that? No, it depends on the vibe you have with him. Oh, no, we I mean, no, you, you know you, how he's going to put it like he's going to say that oh there is this girl hitting on me yeah. at work and yeah. he won't say his part he's going to put it on the secretary and when i pass she'll be looking at me this way meanwhile there's something going on mm. so at that point i'm also getting a clue i mm. won't wait for his coming to me and then i had sex with the part with my secretary hell no 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 <laughs> obviously from the conversations <laughs> i will pick, no. i'll be picking up stuff yeah. from it yeah because that's what you tell me that the secretary i don't know when i came the morning she came to do this she sent me this they will say their parts very nice so very nice but they won't <laughs> say that bro. Um, <laughs> and uh, this is super story <laughs> life yes. and death and death and sorrow <laughs> 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 Why men? Oh, men. Why Fear men? Fear men. Fear men. Oh, oh. Fear <laughs> men. But there are good men out there. I know oh, a few good are. men. They I know are. a few good men. Should are. I mention some names? <laughs> Should I, me- I know no, a few let's, good let's men. Let's keep it for now. Keep it in the fridge. Mm. Yeah, yeah. A bear coat. We can't go. But if, 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 if you are in a girl's group and then your friends are sharing passwords with their partners, do you think that that would influence you in any way to share mm-hmm. yours with your not partner. Not at all. Not at all. <laughs> oh, no, with me, with me, I won't do that because my friends are doing it or I'm doing yeah. it willingly. I'm not going to do it because someone yeah. agreed to do this. Someone is mm-hmm. doing it with his partner, so I have to do that. No, no, no. That's no, their relationship. Yes, it has nothing yes, to do with yes. yours. For you know, you sharing your password with him will even make him feel that no, you're yeah, setting a trap for him. So no, I don't think their trap relationship say. style would influence. Him. Was the trap mm. say. <laughs> Maybe she wants to know what goes on on your phone, but mm. she can't ask straight away. Baby, give me your phone. Let me check. So she will give you hers. Then you would be, you know, coerced to also give her yours. Then now she will see everything. Mm. You get it. So that's that's a trap. Hmm. But hmm. if 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 your partner shares his password with you, and then he doesn't have a problem flirting with other people, and he leaves it there, knowing that you have the password, <laughs> and you will sneak and look at it, is that disrespectful? To some extent, it is. 
and it depends on the vibe you have with him if you guys are that open mm. i mean you would be go you would be cool he will know you'll be cool seeing that but if more relationship now yeah yes christopher the nba flatten Flatten. how is that disrespectful to some extent okay so a uh, no. yes crystal relationship now nah, it will be disrespectful okay. did you get okay. did you get what okay. i'm saying okay i'm saying that for example if you're in a relationship with somebody and the mm-hmm. person has given you his password you have the password to his phone his yeah. um whatsapp instagram whatever people put passwords on their whatsapp you people yeah. we are looking at you yeah <laughs> yeah i see all of you Side eye. yeah you're, you're all cheating <laughs> period you can't tell us anything anything else <laughs> oh no if the person gives you his password and then you he knows he has knowledge that you have my password and you have the tendency of going through <laughs> his phone but he still go, goes about flirting with other people and then chit chatting doing whatever he wants to do with other knowing fully well not deleting them <laughs> do you think yeah. that is disrespectful oh okay 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 at this point i feel like it is disrespectful because you know very well that i have access to that mm. and then you still go ahead entertaining other ladies in your dm flirting with them uh and what, what type of flirting go into the flirting baby you are beautiful oh that's no compliment yeah. just compliment or maybe like they go out they talk about naughty stuff um the sex okay. chat why are you complimenting somebody else? I want to know sex chats or something. You can't see this goddess. Uh-uh. <laughs> no, you know, maybe okay with you. A guy can uh hey, when why you, are post, you pointing <laughs> at me? I need to face it directly <laughs> now. Maybe you post a picture on your status and then a guy compliments, Oh, you're pretty. That's that's cool. a state that's that's, no, that's so a fact. Can, so why that's you a fact. why do you want to attack that's, him? That's a fact. <laughs> why do why do you want to attack him when that, he's when is <laughs> when he's complimenting <laughs> other girls? Why you know, does that attack him? You, you know, I saw this meme that um, that th- this girl said that why is her boyfriend happy or celebrating another girl's birthday? You see, when it's somebody's birthday oh. and then they post, it's like, why are you happy that she's alive? Why are you happy about her sister? Like, oh no, that's extreme. Oh, why? Oh. You people are not jealous like that, so. Yeah. Me, I'm very jealous, and with me, I'm very selfish. I don't want to share my love with anybody. Okay, no one no wants way. to share. Okay, well, um, some okay, people well. want to, but okay, maybe and I know I've been asking, no I think share. mommy would like to share her share love. Share whoever <laughs> <laughs> with who understanding your friend. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> if you come near my boyfriend, you will see. <laughs> don't come near my boyfriend, yeah. but you know, there are some people who'd also take the password. Go through their phone, but not send mobile money to themselves. <laughs> <laughs> See the messages, cry in the middle of the night, and still stay there. Hey, cry. That's how I'm like. What you don't know doesn't kill you. What yes. you want there? What you know? People will take their WhatsApp and they maybe search for love, search for sex. You want to see it, so you <laughs> put in it. Don't cry. So what you don't know doesn't kill ah, you. That's I don't the trick. Search I don't, for love, search for I, sex. I don't know. <laughs> I heard it now. I heard it. No, no, no. The way you spoke, you've done it before. <laughs> don't do that. I've not heard it before. Search, so no, I'm not telling me. you to find a woman. You search for no. love. love. <laughs> all the conversations, different, different. Okay. They all come. Oh yeah, what you don't know doesn't kill you. So with me. I won't go further. Mm-mm-mm. I'll just I'll, so I'll know my boundaries now. I can have your phone, maybe um hotspotting our Wi-Fi or something, <laughs> but I won't go to the extent of reading your messages. Yeah. Hmm, I'll die. No, I can't. You know, if you if you trust your mind so so much, yeah, yeah, when you see this little need. thing, no, when you see this little thing there, it will mm. break you down. They'll be <laughs> like, you least expected that from him. Mm. They are seeing this. Ha, huh, trust me. You you just go down like that. So mm. what you don't know doesn't kill you. Mm. You wake up in the middle of the night and look at him. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like knocking him, slapping him. Oh no. <laughs> hey. Hmm. You go through it and things that he's never said to you, he's busy saying to other I'm women, girl. other girls. But hey, you see, th- those are the heart eggs I spoke about earlier. <laughs> don't don't go there. What what did you say? <laughs> what the statements you made yeah what you don't know doesn't kill doesn't you, kill you. Yes. don't go there don't mm. read it if you hadn't read it you wouldn't have known right so don't Simple. read it fair, fair, fair. just mm-hmm. let it be but if you know we know we have people who are very strong they can take this thing so if you are strong like that no yeah, you can't can go I can't. me i'm very soft very emotional so i can't stand such a thing no way mm-hmm. 
You they don't read it. Saturday he will get married. He will be sitting in the house cooking wache and he will get married to somebody else. Um, you end up laying the bed now. I'm ready. <laughs> You'll be doing understanding girlfriend sweeping and cleaning the room. That's Saturday. Watch a big t-shirt and a flip-flop. Oh my house girl. Oh 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 come here about gardens with the Oh No, but I I I will feel comfortable sharing my phone's password with you, my Instagram password with you. I don't have Facebook. I've created about 50. I don't remember the password. <laughs> <Facebook, no. laughs> I, would, I would feel free to share it with you. But, okay, let me let me put it this way. Do you have a problem with the response your partner is giving to a message that he's gotten or the fact that this message is coming into um, the, your partner? Come again. For example, let me put it in a scenario. If you're in a relationship with somebody and then some another girl is testing your boyfriend, hi baby, good morning. Did you have a good night's sleep? Hey, hey the way you <laughs> <Hey. laughs> well, the the <laughs> baby say I can't even text my boyfriend, baby. Hi baby. Hey, 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 hey baby say how you know, sometimes it would depend what actually um yeah. like let me say correlated that thing. It would depend um from the previous chats. Maybe I didn't see the previous chat, but mm-hmm. what came in because for a girl to text you hi baby for the first time, if you don't entertain her, she tries it for the second, third time, and you still don't entertain her. Trust me, yeah, she's not she's not going to go ahead with hi baby. But whenever mm-hmm. she tells hi baby, then give her hi boo boo. Hi, it will continue like that. The next thing, it's yielding into something else. So in this case, I'll look at how the whole thing started first mm-hmm. before judging my partner. But maybe when I see that it started like a mutual thing. And later, the girl all of a sudden started with, or maybe business something. Yeah. And all of a sudden, the girl chipped in with hi baby, and my husband, my baby hasn't, uh, my partner well, hasn't. Identical <laughs> husband. Ah. <laughs> yeah, give us the ring. <laughs> yes. So, and then my partner responds with hi boo boo. Mm. Not for the first time, not for the second time. That is when I can hold him. I can now come to him, attack him fully. Mm. But then, when if he doesn't, he ignores that message, or yeah. he always texts with the person maybe hi Belinda. It is normal. With that one, I'll, I'll just accept it that way. I'll manage it now. Who is Belinda? Yes. <laughs> I know you have Belinda in my, in my contact list. <laughs> your, your hubby will see this and start thinking, hey, do I have Belinda in my contact list? I'm writing my You could ask me, ask me, ask me, ask me. No evidence. Havoc. Hilary, would you have a problem with how your partner responds to a message or what do you find? <laughs> <laughs> oh, if I'm a kakra, but maybe saying, well, maybe it it depends on what preceded those messages. Maybe you had that, you know, friendly type of vibe. That's cool. But if I read more into the message and I realize no, there's something there, then I would definitely have a problem. Cause baby say, good morning, baby. How was your <laughs> Hi, sleep? Baby. What what are, are you up to today? <laughs> This I should be asking. There you are. Asking, how was your sleep? Yeah, Where are you going to? Now. Hey, no, 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 that <laughs> one. There will be a problem. Baby, say for the baby, there no problem. Problem. So the baby, na na how? Yeah. And your bed, your bed, fell down. Hi, love. Yeah, my love. Come here. I need you to come because I like that thing. Come here. Come here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopeless romantic. Interesting. Hi, baby. Good morning. <laughs> good morning, my love. Hey, you're not part Did you sleep morning, well? Hey. I should be asking that. Not you. Where from you, Ufi? I'm not where from you, Ufi. <laughs> if you can't stand it, just don't go through it. Yeah. Ah, if you so can't stand spare it. yourself that heartache. <laughs> but if you don't go through it, too, you would never know. You have to know your stance. But sometimes, like, through his actions. Yeah. Through his, for instance, every weekend. Your boyfriend tells you he's not available every weekend. Mm. Would you start suspecting something? Every weekend, I'm too quiet. Every weekend, he's not around. He can't go with you too. Or your event organizer. <laughs> or your event organizer. <laughs> but then, we but know, then, we know. When, when he takes pictures, he's taking just him. We don't see those around him. <laughs> that should be a red flag. <laughs> no, you should be yeah, he's alone. You should Island. see all this. Like, event organizer, oh. yeah, you definitely have people around you. But <laughs> now, but they be a selfie. Everything. No, how? <laughs> So you know his actions, you get to know your stance. Hey, babe, how come on quite every weekend you are traveling? Hey. Every, you can't go with me too. Event organizers. Oh, you call they give, What they give them a room to sleep in? 
um, 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 so he can oh, equally watch oh, yeah so he can equally go with the you. event you are going for let me see how the setup is i just want to admire the setup <laughs> let, let me ah, see you don't know men hey man they would ah they will, um, the event fear setup. they will go there and then take a video of the uh, whole plan and send it to you fear they men. will do that this life fear and men starting, if you tell him to streak you know there are filters that allows you to yeah. set yeah. old videos old as videos. if it is a fresh streak <laughs> <laughs> yeah so he can equally use that and then yeah. streak it to you like a fresh yeah. video so babe i'll go with you the next weekend you are going for your event plan <laughs> simple okay that's yes. week we didn't do events <laughs> <laughs> it's not as if i question you all the time and this is it's not too much to ask for i'm just i'm just like oh this time babe i would like to go with you yeah let me just be an escort plus one Ah, it won't change anything (laughs) now simple <laughs> <laughs> the way you girls are attacking boys i'm not happy about it i'm not happy about it i have they to be for us, we are ready. I, no I'm, I'm today i'm standing in for all the men because i've also seen a video of a girl mm. who's going to the nightclub with a hair bonnet <laughs> yes her boyfriend called that baby where are you or did you take trade and say baby i'm ah, sleeping ah, you, <laughs> in the I bathroom can... so 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 girls you girls that's why that's why some of you don't want to share your passwords hey and, don't and, attack and us oh, don't <laughs> attack us that's why some no, of you don't want to speak to me directly passwords. don't <laughs> attack us you know what you're saying yeah, yeah. i saw a sim laughing the girl yeah. went with her bed sheet. i think she went for a sleepover so when the boy actually called and uh, you know the guy knows her bed sheet and everything <laughs> so she just laid it down and then like babe i'm home i'm sleeping and i oh, okay he had already seen the best sheet and he knew the babe was home but she was somewhere else so yeah mm. right what you say babies are smart <laughs> men are also smart yes yes hey we know please i'm not like that i'm a good girl you know <laughs> like me i'll give you everything what do you want baby Habibi, what do you what do you want? <laughs> then then add your momo password. Eh, me, I'll give it to you. Oh, really? Minus seventy-five. <laughs> <laughs> you, you clear the debt for you, don't worry. <laughs> minus seventy-five. If you want, ha- come for it, baby. Come for, come for my cards. Whatever <laughs> you want. Just say, oh my goodness, <laughs> what do you want? All your handles, everything. Take it. Ever <laughs> ready? Take it, cause I'm I'm a very lazy person. I'm I'm the type of person if I get, for example, if I get a series. That I'm watching on Netflix or um, Amazon Prime. Mm-hmm. Listen, I'll even forget to eat. <laughs> I'll forget everything. I just I don't want it to end. I don't want mm. to miss anything. I want to hear the. Bang, bang. <laughs> I want to hear from start to finish. Yeah. So, I'm a very lazy person. Mm. So you can have it. Have it. Please have it and go <laughs> leave me alone. Because I feel I feel like that is another way of building trust. If you are sharing your password with your partner you are sharing you are letting that's how i feel i may be right i may be wrong i mean to some extent it does you are making the person feel and understand that look it is you and i we are logged in brothel logged in (laughs) Oba hmm. or the key in movie. We are, no, but not me though. It's Becky. We are, <laughs> we are logged in. The, the two of us are, mm-hmm. you know, forever. And so mm-hmm. have my phone. Please, the most important thing you have to share with me is your Netflix password. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do, you, do you ladies want that? Oh, obviously, yes. yes. Yeah. I know they are yes. <laughs> hey, girls. <laughs> girls. No problem. <laughs> Hmm. You want the Netflix password, <laughs> mm-hmm. but you can't share your phone password. And your oh, with, with, password. with me, I can share it. Yes, with me, I can share it. It's, hilarious. it's not necessary. It's a problem for Why her. Why is it not necessary? <laughs> is it not necessary to build trust in a relationship? That shouldn't be the basis for building trust. So what should be? Question we did. <laughs> <laughs> no, what should be? You, we, we, we've spoken about, you know, having open conversations. I, I feel there's nothing as open as having my phone. Mm. because that is where i am me like i am truly myself mm. do you understand like i yeah. have my friends i have my mm-hmm. girls whatsapp group don't my girls whatsapp group 
we'll talk about you and that's your friend the one whose head doesn't grow the one whose shoe wasn't nice you know you know how girls are mm. don't open that that one day if you open it yeah mm. well, we'll judge, we'll judge. but apart from that mm. that's that's why i'm i truly i am myself but do you feel like when you share it to there are certain things you would want to keep to yourself that you can't keep to yourself anymore mm, okay we mean like this i'm always like yeah. when it comes to my mom my mom and i are text mm. ha ah, we go into details we gossip we do everything <laughs> so with me yeah the only problem i'll have is when you when you open my mom's message my mom and i are message hey, you've killed me because the secrets yeah. we have just the two of us the things we do and all of that ha ah, hey, if you open you do hey no do. Not <laughs> nothing too far i feel like things we do home you know sometimes you like to sneak some stuff from my dad do things like codedly do you get it (laughs) yeah maybe i want to go out asking for permission for my dad Mm. is a whole stress so maybe i'll just plan with her i just go and all of that so once you go into my mom's test you get to know almost all my activities Mm. i send her videos of everything i do Mm. you've killed me Mm. so that would be my only problem and probably maybe friends group chat mm. that will also be another factor yes so i think this too apart from this too i'm okay mm, apart from this too, you're okay i'm okay hilary <laughs> mm. uh, well i don't really have anything to hide so it wouldn't really be a problem but i just don't think it's necessary i just i just don't understand why you'd ask for it and as she said, our moms, we, we tell them everything. Maybe there are some insults, Why I don't want you to get it, you know. So, yeah, there are some conversations. Yeah. I wouldn't want it there. But mm. if it's there, okay, fine, it's there. But I wouldn't want it there. So you should respect that boundary and, boundary and just not go there. Mm. But I don't really have a problem. But I won't. <laughs> Maybe if I'm madly in love, I will. But I won't. Hey, my first, love. my first... My first thing to do is I want. Your yeah. first thing you do is you want, but I when want. you are madly in love, <laughs> now you are saying in love. Eh? <laughs> Anyways, so guys, you can share your thoughts with us. Would you give your partner your phone's password? Share them with us in the comments section. And don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel because we love you and I know you love us. There's a relationship between you and I. Yes, I know. I see it. It's visible. So please don't be biased just like the page subscribe share and then put your comments in the comments section we'll see you in another video bye